Hello and welcome back to my channel and if this is your first time here, my name is Noemi. In the today's video, I am going to share with you some homemade cleaner recipes and some cleaning and organizing inspiration. I am going to continue the deep cleaning, my fall cleaning and I'm going to start with that spider condo. <laughs> I just call it like that because it gets little sections and the spiders love that. On the spring and on the fall when the sun kind of hits from the lower angle, I get to see more dirt than on the summer or on the winter. So that made me realize that all the surface that is a vertical one like the walls and behind the doors especially behind the doors they get they collect so much dust so i'm going to clean those today as well as many other surfaces that collects dust and then i am going to start to clean the sheets i'm going to put them in a hot cycle and then also i'm going to air out the blankets and pillows on the fresh air and i also going to clean the mattress as well You thought that was ants? Yes. <laughs> Here it does look like ants. It does look like ants. To clean your mattress, you can sprinkle some lavender or ants. It's up to you. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. So lavender that I like to use and I would recommend for everybody. If you have a um, Dyson vacuum cleaner, I would definitely wouldn't recommend the baking soda because it's damaging the motor because it doesn't have uh, bag in there but my vacuum cleaner does just fine with that because I have a vacuum bag in there it protects the motor that way so don't forget if you have a Dyson just you will only use the lavandula but not the baking soda so I'm moving on to the bathroom and I am going to clean again behind the door bathroom was get so much steam from the shower and all the dust and hair sticks to it so if you go and check your wall you will be surprised how much hair and dust sits on it as well on the light fixture so i'm cleaning that one off as well as i vacuum the mattress I go very slowly I speed it up for you guys so you don't have to wait to see the result <laughs> but I like to take my time and just push it very slowly so make sure the vacuum has a time to suck out all the dust Today I am going to use the lavender oil because I just want to go with that theme and this is what I'm going to use in my dryer as a dryer sheet so I just use this balls and somebody was asking me why she doesn't feel the smell of this um, essential oil and I am thinking if you are someone who is switching from 
the store brought uh, fabric softener to the essential oils is definitely it doesn't have that strong smell at all but also because you get used to the strong smell so those fabric softeners are designed to stay in the fabric and in the air so that's why you feel the smell of it all the time but when you stop using those um, chemicals your nose actually will clear out and you will feel the smell better later on so you become more um, sensitive to the smells as well so you will feel better all these essential oils as a result This is something that you can mix ahead of a time so you can prepare more. I like to switch it around so that's why I prepared just this amount and I also like to use additionally that dish soap and vinegar mixture. It's good for everything. It just really cleans everything nicely and I am also going to use some water and vinegar mixture to clean the toilet. check the bottle because <laughs> if you have seen my last video I accidentally used a different one on a mirror <laughs> so I wanted to be sure and I'm just filling up the, the hand soap and then I wiping off the dust from this organizer The sheet is clean so I'm starting to put it on and as I put them into the dryer I like to separate the duvet cover and there's two reasons for that one it dries faster and the second reason is <laughs> when I put the duvet cover in there everything ends up into that duvet cover and it's kind of stays wet in the middle so it's just an easier and faster way to dry it and by this time I aired out the blanket that goes into the duvet cover, the insert and all the pillows as well and I can tell you the whole room smells so fresh at this point and I also washing the curtains at this point and so basically everything that is fabric is being washed and the fabric is the source of the funky smell if you find something in your bedroom that <laughs> has an interesting smell so if you keep the fabric um, part clean and that's why I don't have the the fabric uh, headboard or carpet or rug in there because it's just easier for me to clean and so basically if the fabric is clean in the bedroom it smells fresh
I have a curtain rod from IKEA and it was so slippery so I fixed that problem with a rubber band that I fixed on the sides. So this closet where I keep all the fabrics and just um, linen things and I need to tidy up. It's not as bad but this is the point when I know it can <laughs> go into a really bad direction very fast. So I did a very quick decluttering and just um, organizing them into sections how I use them. And meanwhile I love the idea of having beans in the closet because it's beautiful when I open and the doors but honestly that's why the closet doors are there so I don't see that but once I open the closet I get to see what I have so I can look at it very easily and fast whatever I need so I'm just going to put them into categories like kitchen towels and blankets and I'm going to organize the way that it makes sense to me blanket goes on the bottom so the kids can easily reach it I'm talking about my little one because my older one is already taller than I am <laughs> but this is the system that works for me so well oh and by the way as I'm doing the voiceover I can tell you that this room actually is <laughs> this was recorded before we redid this room so I just wanted to have the other video up sooner because I want to just keep a good rotation between the day in the life and cleaning videos. So this was happening right before we redid this room. I just wanted to clarify that. So make sure you know you didn't go crazy. <laughs> this is the same room and it's just it I recorded before that video. I have lots of cozy fall videos coming up and if you enjoy this type of contents you can keep watching if you click on the icon on the screen because I got a playlist for vlogs or for cleaning inspiration. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys soon. Bye!